Good morning, half of May High School. I'm Elke, and this is the Cougar Campus News. AP registration is now open. Don't delay. See Ms. Tower in the front office if you have any questions. Attention all sophomores. POPs will be held in your social study classes tomorrow and Friday. And for 11th graders, the POPs will be next week. You will be receiving important information from your counselor. Now here's Jay with a report from one of the science classes. Hey guys, let's go check out Dr. Yerby's lab. What are you doing? I'm looking through old yearbooks. Dang, that's crazy. I never ordered one last year. Yeah, neither did I. Well, actually, the yearbook class assigned them for $30, which is over 50% off its original price. It's amazing. Swing by G10 to pick up your yearbook. You can bring $30 cash or write a check out to this name above. Hey Cougars, hope you had a great long weekend. We have a couple of upcoming events and application deadlines to feature today. There's still time to become a Youth Climate Ambassador with the San Mateo County Sustainability Department. Application uh, deadline was extended to today, so you still got time to apply. Also, apply by this Monday, September 9th, to become a Youth Health Ambassador with Star Vista. Receive extensive training in mental health and wellness and become a champion in raising awareness and increasing access to services. This is a 14-week program, mostly online, where you could earn either $700 as a stipend or 50 community service hours, your choice. Visit the Real Life Learning Bulletin Board in the library for more information about these opportunities. Scan the QR code for information about all the opportunities. Have a great day. The varsity volleyball team hosted the annual pumpkin classic this past weekend, finishing 3-1 on the day and claiming third place in the tournament. The half of offense was led by a trio of stars, Amelia Ortolan, Pace the Cougars with 19 kills and an ace. Gabby Harrison contributed 15 kills and a team high 8 aces. Ginger Sullivan also played a key role in 13 kills and 3 aces. The Cougars defense was anchored by Ginger Sullivan who led the team with 21 digs. Kate Billington and Lily Harrison each chipped in with 16 digs apiece. Setting the tempo for the half Bay offense was Lily Harrison, who dished out a huge 37 assist against Macy and Vogel, adding 18 assists. Attention for anyone interested in playing boys basketball this year. There is a mandatory meeting tomorrow at lunch in the gym. Please bring your parents' email contact information. <laughs> Well, the answer to our trivia question from this past Friday, San Jose. Yes, it was San Jose that was the first capital of the state of California. There were a few of you that guessed Benicia or Vallejo, but those towns were capitals after the city of San Jose. We offer our congratulations to Ms. Lundstroth and her advisory period. They were the fastest to answer. And a shout out to Mr. Damon and his advisory class the second fastest to reply. Now today we have a follow-up question about the city of San Jose. Watch your email for the question from me and have a wonderful Wednesday out there. Happy Moon Bay High School.